here we have a 2013 Kawasaki Ninja 300. This bike is h power clear, so it's never been categorized for any insurance or been involved in a major crash. I've seen this video, I'm gonna show you around the bike on all the good and bad points about it. Obviously, starting you off, the fairings are in decent condition on this side. They've got a couple of marks, like down here, just a couple of scratches. And just here, a couple of marks. A slight, light cosmetic marks to the bike, it's nothing major at all. It does have an aftermarket LED tail light. RNG tail tidy with LED indicators on the rear. That's pretty deep plate. Rear tire, still plenty of tread. Wavy brake disc on the rear and the pads are in good condition. Chain and sprocket, nice aftermarket uh, sprocket in very good condition. Got standard rear sets on either side. Pillion foot pegs and seat. Razor mirrors, standard side lights, standard low beam and high beam. It's got the standard screen as well. Front tires with plenty of tread. Brake disc and pads are in excellent condition on the front. It's got the standard integrated indicators and the fairings there, as you can see. Rear swing arms nice and neat. Chain guard is in good condition. Rear mud guard is in excellent condition as well. BST carbon alloys in very good condition, nice and neat. we do have the uh, standard alloys if you do want them changed uh, please let us know but these alloys are completely road legal they are in very good condition there's not a mark to them nice braided brake lines for the front it does have aftermarket handlebars on either side aftermarket levers as well and obviously the standard grips it looks like the bar ends have been removed the so headlight units are nice and clean there's no cloudiness to them which is nice after this side are clean just a couple little marks down here which I've mentioned the bolts do look clean through the bike though engine case in this side is nice and neat it does have the standard shifter with standard shifting on this gearbox underneath here is clean the rear shock does work nicely with no issues on that it does have a aftermarket exhaust system the baffle is installed under this exhaust so it is a little bit quiet but obviously if you remove that will be significantly louder edge case in this side is nice and clean as well it does have a full radiator guard very good clean condition as you can see the forks are nice and neat front mud guard is in very good condition digital dash does work up absolutely fine on this ignition works fine as well including the fuel cap and seat lock steering lock does work as well Obviously the engine does run smooth, gearbox is smooth, clutch has a really good biting point. Currently the bike is covered at just over 21,000 miles. Obviously if you look after it, it will last you quite a while. We have had one of these at over 50k miles and it was running nice. Uh, it does have a tank protector sticker down the middle. The tank does have a little bit of uh, wear and tear to the paintwork, but it's nothing major. I have taken a close up photo for you, you can see it more up close. But everything else on this bike is in very good condition. There's a few general marks from day to day use. Nothing major to the bike at all. It's in very good condition. I believe the bike has also been dynoed. If we have the papers, they will be mentioned in the ad. But it's a very clean bike, ready to ride away. But that'll be everything for this Kawasaki Ninja 300. Thank you.